Nick, you just said is that. I'm asking the question. Oh, was that a good game or what? How do you describe what you just coached through? Well, I'll tell you what. The resiliency of our team to come back in the second half. Tua did a great job, gave us a little spark. Defense picked it up to overcome the adversity of missing the field goal in regular and then go and win the game in overtime. It's a great football game. you got to give Georgia a lot of credit. They really played well in the game. But I'm so proud of our players for the way they come back in the game after the first half we played was not very good. What led to the decision and what did you tell Tua? Well, I just thought we had to throw the ball in the game and I thought he could do it better. Um, you know, so, and he did. He did a good job. We made some plays in the passing game. So, hey, it's just a great win, man. I'm so happy for uh, Alabama fans. Great for our players. Uh, unbelievable. After what happened last year, losing with one second to go, the mantra all season was finish. How did you coach your team to do that tonight? What spirit did they show you, Nick? Well, you know, I told them in the beginning, I said, look, I said, all we got to do is execute. We made so many mistakes in the first half. I mean, we were shooting in ourselves in the foot left and right. So I said, if we just go have poise and focused execute like we do all the time, that's who we are. We'll have a chance to get back in this game. And the Pairs believed it and came back and did a great job. You're a sixth national championship. You tie Bear Bryant for most in the poll era. Take a second and hear that. What does that mean to you? You know, right now, I'm, I'm just happy for all these folks here. I'm, I'm happy for all these folks. I'm happy for our players. I don't care anything about that, to be honest with you. Th this was a great win for our, our players, and I've never been happier in my life. Never. Never. <laughs> Congratulations, Nick.